Hi YouTube, it's your girl Keisha. Today I have a special treat. Okay, so today is my first time ever going to Chipotle. No, I'm not lying. First time. And so the girl was like, is this your first time? She said, I overheard you say it's your first time you never eaten here. I was like, I never ate at Chipotle. She's like, she walked up to the other girl. She's like, oh, she's the first time I give her a courtesy meal. I was like, oh, shit. Free food! Oh, my God. Free food. Free food. So I thought that the tacos were so small. But then the girl was like, um... What kind of stuff did you want on your tacos? But I had, I was like, oh, those tacos look small. So I thought I was going to get two. And, you know, a big girl like me can't be just eating those two small tacos, right? So I was like, oh, yeah, I'll take the tacos. I was like, oh, maybe I should get a little small. The burrito bowl looked small, right? I ain't never had no Chipotle. Come on now. Y'all know I ain't never had no Chipotle. Because if I did, I would have did a mock bonk on that Chipotle. <laughs> Got me some napkins. <laughs> This is sad when you go to a restaurant and just get this many napkins. I might got a couple more in here. Hold on. I got one more napkin. Because restaurants, you're so used to your restaurants giving you two or three napkins. And that's what I picked up, two or three napkins. I'm so used to restaurants doing that stuff to me. And anyways, so I'm like, okay, free food. Who can pass a free food? Put you there for a minute. I wasn't going to pass on no free food. So... <laughs> I'm getting my camera back tomorrow, y'all. So, woohoo! Say amen to the can cam. Move that broom out the way. I don't know where the broom is. I am so sorry. Anyways, I'm stand up for this. I ain't gonna stand up. Let me stand up. Show y'all what I got here. The bowl. The ball. The ball. Not gonna do it. Not gonna do it. Y'all know I'm crazy. I'm not gonna do it today. Anyways. So I can't eat anything spicy, right? So I got this chicken bowl. First I was like, what's the barracuda bowl? She was like, it's like a barbacoa. I was like, oh yeah, what's that? She's like, that's our spicy one. I was like, well, can I get the steak? She's like, oh, that's our second spicy. Okay, so the first spicy is the barracuda bowl, and the second is the steak, and the third is the chicken. <laughs> Y'all know I got chicken, right? Because I'm, I'm black. I don't know why. In case y'all didn't notice, I was black. I am Negro. I have no idea what the hell carnitas is. So I'm a Negro. Just like pico de gallo. That's just tomato with some cilantro and stuff mixed. Um, that ain't no pico de gallo. I mean, it might be called pico de gallo, but... Um, I mean, it's, it's like it, but... They ain't what we call it. We call this... Get those chopped ass tomatoes over here in this bowl! First time Chipotle eater, and I like it. I actually like it. Mm hmm. I don't know what I'm doing with the because it's big. I ain't gonna lie. Like I said, I ordered the tacos and they were small. So I was like, girl can't eat no taco like that. This big girl like me, two tacos. But when I ordered tacos, I didn't see her make the other bread. I thought she was just giving me two tacos. When she was like, they made the burrito bowl, whatever. She was like, what you want your tacos? I was like, oh, some cheese. And, um. No, just make it plain, you know what I'm saying? But this bowl right here. Mm. Mm. 
I'm sorry. If you have never eaten at Chipotle, this is from a first timer. This is a very good, this is good. So, Chipotle gave me this bowl for free. Not the bowl, but the food inside of it. I guess we would say the bowl, too. Yay! But the food in the bowl Yay! for free. If y'all hear noise in the background, of course, y'all know that's my autistic nephew, Jaden. He screams so loud, like, ring your ears out most of the time. I want to thank you guys for the, just subscribe to me. I really appreciate your support. Um, it means a lot because I like doing stuff and I just, you know, no matter how many subscribers I get, I'm going to keep doing me and pe keep being me. So, but I thank you guys for subscribing to me and supporting me and commenting. It really helps me out. It shows that. I'm appreciative in the community of Mark Mom. I'm gonna tell you, woo! The lemonade and Sprite mixed together is the, that's good. I'm going to tell y'all, if y'all never ever mix Coca-Cola and Full Throttle together, oh my God, that is like the best drink. We live by Circle K. And one of our maintenance guys here at the apartment complex, he's like, hey, can you go get me a drink? Because I think he likes me, but I don't know. He was like, hey, can you go get me a drink? And I was like, yeah. He was like, can I get a Coca-Cola and Full Throttle? Because I used to work at Circle K, right? I was like, yeah, I'll go get you a drink. So I went over there and go get him a drink. And he was like, I was like, hmm. So my son accidentally tastes his drink when we were coming home. And my son was like, ooh, that's good. So then, you know, follow the leader. And now every time I go to Circle K, I get full a throttle mixed with Coca-Cola. Which is good. This is good. I'm sorry. This Chipotle chicken bowl is really good. I will give you a bike, however, not a bike. I will give you a bite. However, there's glass. Plastic, whatever you want to say, in between us. Too bad you can scratch and sniff the monitor there. Scratch, sniff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. For those of you guys that don't know, I work for Discover. I just got off of work. And I like my job. I told you guys I had a promotion. And I love it. I work for the collections department. And I'm telling you, there is some people that you just love talking to. They be like, he should be on the phone for 20, 30 minutes with these customers. Not only if I have a heart to help people, I just like talking to people. And that's one thing about me is I love talking to people. And some of my uh, supervisors, the negotiators, specialists, he's like, I love listening to your calls because you just sit there and you write in with the customers. Like one lady, she, um, her husband had died. And I was just talking to her and talking to her. And I, my condolences and everything. And you would think you were not going to get a payment from this lady. But I wound up getting the payment from, and I was like, it's kind of weird how people be like, oh, my husband died. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Now, let's talk about this payment. No, we don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. 
I mean, I love Discover Card. I really, truly love them. But I like talking to my customers. And I'm going to tell you, it shows that I like talking to my customers. Because I saw husband husband at work at 10.30 this morning. I took PTO and didn't come in until 12. Now, from 12 to 7, I got off at 7. When I got in, I just started talking to people. And by the time I left at 7 o'clock, I was on top of the leaderboard. Like, I've been there all day. And our goal is to make a certain amount of money. I was on top of the leaderboard. It's because I talked to my customers. I'd be like, hi, this is Lakeisha. And this call may be recorded for quality insurance or quality, insure quality services. I say that. And I'll be like, the reason why I'm calling Mr. Such and Such or Mrs. Such and Such is because I showed that we're missing your maze payment. And I'd like to set something up with you today, tomorrow, whatever works best for you. And I get to talking to them. I want to know what is going on with you that you could not make this payment. So I can work with you. And that's how Discover is like, I'm going to tell you, I have a Visa card, MasterCard. I have all these cards. And Discover is like this true once I start working inside of Discover card, I see that they are true for their philosophy. They want to help customers out. So if you ever, and I know some people like, oh, this girl is crazy. She talked about credit card. But no, if you ever get in that, if you have a Discover card and you ever get in that bind, work something out with Discover card because they are there to help you. They might say, oh, no, we not have this program. But they have programs to help you. And so I do really enjoy working for Discover card. I do. Yeah, I know. I don't like to make long, long videos. The reason why, because I seem like I get bored sometimes making them. When I feel like I'm getting bored, I'll stop my video. And the reason why is because I don't want to bore my audience. I really don't. I mean, I'm a goofy person, but I don't want to bore my audience. And so, of course, you know, I'm not even finished with the bowl, but we had 13 minutes almost. I'm going to finish this tonight. Now see, if I had my camera, I'd be able to cut all this stuff out and be like, oh, well, we had 13 minutes, blah, blah, blah. Right now, y'all getting uncut, realistic, my ball. How should I pose? You have won a new car. Adios.